hi guys welcome to my channel and how to download gigabyte motherboard driver so first you have to come this site www.gigabyte.com this is officially website so you can download the driver so after that right hand side this is search icon and then enter the model number of motherboard b5 850 gaming x wi-fi 6e and then hit enter after that click on product and you can see uh, this is your motherboard title on so this is your motherboard click on support then select your operating system windows 10 and 11 so both operating system installations process same and first guys download then after show you installation so audio driver audio driver and click to download slow down chipset md chipset driver and same click to download slow down land driver real tech LAN driver and click to download wi-fi and bluetooth bluetooth driver wi-fi driver and download one after that you can see it is start downloading in the download box so it is completed then show you how to install and you just click on this icons where it is downloading it will open it so this is your driver so wait for complete so guys it is completed so first download all driver first select this and right click and extract all and same locations just extract it okay it will open and close it okay this created this folder you can see then info update right click extract all extract and same close it you can then this one right click and extract all one by one do that then this right click extract all and then extract So one by one extract all or your driver. Otherwise you can without extract and you just double click to install. But sometime we get the issues in this last. then it is done and close it then just right click to refresh it so this is your actual driver and this is also your but this is extracted so guys first open this select right click 
and run as administrator. Then click on yes. So wait few seconds is installing. It will take some time. Okay, it will close automatically means this is install it. Okay, it is closed automatically means this is installed. Then go to back. Then second one. Same select and right click to administrator run as administrator and then yes So it is closed automatically means this is installed. Go back, then third one. Just select and right click to run as administrator. Then click on yes. because the installation process is very simple so it is closed automatically means this is installed then fourth one open select right click to run as the administrator then click on yes So it is closed automatically means install and then come to back again. Then fifth one. Same select and right click to run as administrator. Then click on yes. So it is closed automatically means this is installed then back then second last this one and this is last so open this select right click to run as administrator after that click on yes So it is closed means this is installed back 
and last one graphic driver just open it and the same select and right click to run as administrator then click on yes So this is installing driver, this is graphic card driver, display driver, monitor driver, you can say that. So it will set them, take, take some time after install the all driver then restart your system. Okay, restart so important for your system after install the driver. Okay, thank you.